Sherry Citron, the director of Oncology Support, joins us live with those details. Sherry, good to have you on the show. Good morning to you. Thank you so much. Good morning good to morning. you. Good morning. You've been holding this party for 26 years. Can you explain just how important events like this are for cancer survivors? Absolutely. This is an event we look forward to each year. We are with our patients um, in the Dewberry Family Cancer Resource Center from the time of diagnosis, um, helping them navigate treatments, and then into survivorship. So cancer can be really tough, and this is an opportunity for us to reflect back on their experiences and celebrate with them. So you say that you have been with the patients all the time from the beginning of their treatment and to the end. Tell us more about how the Cancer Resource Center supports patients and how they did so during the pandemic. It was tough, you know, just because uh, we had a pandemic doesn't mean that our patients were not being diagnosed with cancer. And it was even more isolating than usual because they were distanced oftentimes from their loved ones. They couldn't see their family and friends. They would come in for their chemo appointments and couldn't have any visitors. So we would sit with them hold you know, their hands and really offer them that emotional support that would hopefully uh, get them through some difficult times. Mm, wow, you definitely uh, developed a connection, I'm sure, with the patients over that time. So there are reports, we've been reporting about people missing important screenings during the pandemic. Can you explain the importance of keeping those appointments? Absolutely. The longer you wait to come in and get checked out, uh, whatever screening it is that you're due for, you need to continue with those screenings. The earlier you get diagnosed, the better your chances are for curative treatment and survival. And that uh, bodes the best outcome for the patient. So the pandemic uh, changed last year's event. How will it be different this year? Well, this year, we're still trying to offer a safe opportunity for us to be able to see and congratulate our patients and for our community of survivors to network with each other. So it's going to be an outdoor event, um, but it will be um, masked and socially distant so that our survivors can come, enjoy some ice cream, listen to some music, get a massage, but still feel comfortable in an environment where we want to make sure that they are uh, safe and happy. And uh, are you expecting a big turnout this year? We are. Typically, we have around 200 survivors who come with their families. We're trying to keep it a little bit smaller, but we anticipate that there will be about 100 patients that will stop by. Uh, best of luck with it. Sherry Sutron is the Director of Oncology Support at the Virginia Hospital Center.